That wind advisory that was in effect just expired, but that doesn't mean the wind is going away anytime soon. Plus, a judge orders the man accused of attacking her to come back to court. It's expected to happen this week in the case. The Raider season has come to an end, but the conversation for the next head coach is just getting started. A win on Sunday and a decision forthcoming from owner Mark Davis. Vincent Kevin inside Allegiant Stadium. All your silver and black coverage straight ahead. We are local. Las Vegas. Fox 5 News starts now. A cold and very windy Sunday for us in the Valley. The National Weather Service says a cold front brought freezing temperatures in the early morning. And along with them, wind gusts between 40 and 50 miles an hour. And that led to some flight delays at Harry Reid Airport, where almost 300 flights were delayed and 18 were canceled. Les, I thought I was going to blow away in that wind today. So what can we expect coming up for the rest of the week? Well, there's a good news and bad news scenario here for us. Number one, the, uh, the wind advisory, it's done. Just expired. However, that doesn't mean that wind is going to be a whole lot calmer. In fact, we're going to be below wind criteria for an advisory. So we're going to still see some pretty brisk winds for the overnight hours and into tomorrow as well. You're looking at our sunset cam, you can see it's shaking because of that wind that continues to blow here in the Las Vegas Valley. And as we look at what's happening from our strat cam, uh, it's 43 degrees right now, a northwest wind at 20 miles per hour. Uh, humidity 22%, the dew points temperature 6 degrees.